I remember the American soldiers coming yeah. when I was about 10 probably uh -huh. mm. and they were billeted in the, on the uh, Hamilton Road and down they took over Barry's mm -hmm. and they used to, um, they had a band, this is what I, I used to sit with, with my friend Winnie mm -hmm. on her way to Picky Pool and we used to sit in the wall and watch them uh, exercising up and down Queen's Parade and playing their instruments. And they were doing all the Glenn Miller songs. I mean, I knew oh, all the Glenn Miller songs, note by note by note. Yeah. It was wonderful. And there was one wee fella, and he was about this height, and he, he was with them every day, and they actually got a little uniform made for him. Oh. But uh, he used to walk up and down with them. That's brilliant. You imagine that and they always had nice uniforms, mm -hmm. and this wee fella, mm -hmm. his oh. name was Maher or something, oh. Maher. Yeah. Mm -hmm. That's lovely. <laughs> That's and then taking in Queen's Parade, of course, there were Capronis. The dance. The corner, yeah. which is the YMC now. No, the yeah. dance hall was around Ballyhome. I know that. Oh, right. Uh -huh. So, what was the Capronis uh, there? Ice cream. Ice cream. Ice big, ice cream. Ice, big ice cream shop. And the staircase was pure marble. I think it was brought over. I'm, I'm not sure because they, being right. Italian. Yeah. Like, it oh. was buzzing, but nobody mm. went abroad in those days. No. I mean, uh, it wasn't even thought of. I always really remember the sunny days. Yeah, it's those. <laughs> but I wouldn't have cared if it thundered and lightning. Mm. If I came home from school, yeah. I wanted to go to Picky Pool. Ah, yes. that right? it. Well, if you, got, if you got wet in the sea mm -hmm. and came in, it Aye. was like a bath. It was yeah. lovely. Mm -hmm. And you remember Andy? Andy Johnson was the caretaker uh, around at the pool and he ran it. Yeah. It was his own home, That's and he had right. so many wee girls and boys that he taught to swim. Mm -hmm. didn't and if I was camp. lucky and got back down to the beginning of that bit that takes you round, and he was coming, he rode on his bike from the Tandy Boy Road where he lived, I got a, a ride round <laughs> on the bar. <laughs> and then my husband as well as being a jeweller, he was a musician as well, and he had his own band, and played at all the golf clubs. I sang with the band when he was in band before the children were born, and then another girl and I sang together, and he played for us, and um, we were on top time in for television. That was 1955, way back, mm -hmm. way back when Pussy wasn't even a kitten. Mm -hmm. <laughs> it was good fun. Uh -huh. was That's good fun. That's brilliant. And yeah. appeared with quite a lot of people. Uh, you've probably heard of, maybe you haven't. Your father would. Uh, Joe Loss and his orchestra, have you ever heard of Joe Loss? No, no. no. Well, that was a British band. Right, okay. He was all around the time, um, Glenn Miller, mm -hmm. around that time. You know the way Huey Green, do you remember Huey Green? Sorry, oh, no. too, young, too, too young, but it was <laughs> before that there was a Carol Levis, and he had discoveries, the way they do the X Factor now. Uh -huh. And we were with him for a week, and he wanted us to tour with him, but Fred had the business, so that was wow. out. Your husband's father that started the yes, Jewish when I poured okay. it down. Sorry, you missed the sale <laughs> because he said uh, we're closing in a week's time. We got an offer for the shop, uh -huh. and uh, I said, "Well, are you having a sale? You're taking so much off." He said, "No, everything's been at half price right from the start." And that was the way it went. Well, it was January, and the snow was on the ground, and it was blowing a blizzard, and there was a queue outside the shop that went halfway down the main street, <coughs> and we let so many in, and then I said, Fred, you're going to have to bolt the door, I can't do that. I said, you're going to have to. You know, you're going to have to until we get yeah. some room yeah. in the shop. Yeah. They would have bought the wallpaper off the walls if they could, really. Right. And yeah. never saw stuff disappear this way. Oh. And all our customers, like the, without exaggeration, they were all friends, mm -hmm. weren't they? You know, yeah. you, and the, there was a few of them used to come in on a Saturday morning, always at the time we had the coffee on, mm. and have coffee with us, just yeah. standing at the bottom of the counter. Oh dear! Oh, we managed to laugh.